Brad Day's Plant Pathology Lab at Michigan State University has acquired a new research tool to help researchers better understand the cellular structure of plant life. What we have here is a new laser capture micro dissection instrument and what it is going to enable us to do is to go in and isolate single cells from living tissue and analyze the genetic component of the basis of life, the single cell, and ask how does an event in that cell contribute to the overall development and processes within plants. This is a, is a sophisticated scalpel. It's allowing you to go in very precisely and extract the cells that you're interested in. Thanks to an NSFR grant, the instrument will allow Day and others to learn how a pathogen attacks a cell and how that single cell communicates danger to the rest of the plant. Right, so my lab is going to be very interested in looking at what's going on in a single cell and more importantly, how does a single cell that's infected communicate to the rest of the plant that, hey, we're under attack, get ready, next door neighbor, guy down the road, let's get ready. There's a pathogen that is attacking me. I'm going to go ahead and I'm, I will die as a result of this, but the next cell. And so this the cell to cell communication is a very important event in development of all organisms, whether it's plants, animals, insects. The new technology could have a huge impact on future human health issues. Again, Brad Day. A lot of what we know about disease research in plants provides foundation for disease research in humans and vice versa.